So if it was to do with our morals, we don't think that's right. It's a Chester city centre. Where the hell have I got us? <laughs> What's an iPhone, Sham? I'll show you. We'll do one now. This is, is the problem with people on the tube. Do Juices are flowing now, aren't they? No. Oh my gosh, he queefs so loud. I've been sleeping with a married man for months and I went to school with his daughter. Okay. It says record, that's what it is. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> Honey. Get out of the way, record. <laughs> Earlier when Shit. I was doing a live, someone was sending me love hearts and I thought I had something on my face. But it was, it was like running through me. Hello, honey. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you just joined me now, then hi, my name's Imogen. My name's Spencer. Sorry for the phone Surely here. by now, this, but it could be someone's first time. True, you don't know. You but don't know. If it's not, welcome back. Mm -hmm. Good to see you. Mm -hmm. And I hope you've been in eagerly anticipating this video. It is currently Friday night at 7.55 in the evening. Mm -hmm. We've just had dinner, we've got Renalia down, yes. but we are going away to see our family this weekend, so we know we need to film this video for Tuesday. So if you're watching this on Tuesday, just know that we're on a Friday night filming. We're knackered and we're yeah. ready, we're pumped, yeah. and we are very excited because we are gonna on. be answering your assumptions. Sorry the phone's here, but the phone's getting ready to be looked at. So many of you sent me so many assumptions. Oh, not assumptions, what am I Confessions. At? Oh baby, I've done it wrong. What? Well, I said the whole title wrong. Have you? What is it? We are reacting to your confession. You have sent us such brilliant confessions, all anonymously, mm -hmm. and we are going to be reacting to them now. I've got so many, so I'm so excited. Mills so is red oh, stuff. Sorry, I've just said I'm so exciting. Yeah, you are exciting. You get me so excited. <laughs> Uh, Mills has read some, I have yeah. no, no idea, no, 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 so no, no, no. let's get in with so it. So they are going to be juicy confessions. Let's go. Yeah, sorry angels, all over the place, right, don't look, really. I won't look, I'm looking at the camera. So. Big regret, slept with my dad's work friend after bumping into him on a night out. Wow. How old is your dad's work friend? Yeah. How old are you? you? Obviously, oh, really quickly, disclaimer, if you are under the age of consent, and or family don't like you watching things like this, yeah. please don't watch these videos. This is, these are um, explicit, they are um, not rated PG. Yeah. So if you- Over you know, 18s? Yes, no, over 16s, but oh, obviously we 16, do know that course, yeah. under 16 year olds do have sex, yeah. we know that, yeah. but we can't promote things like that. Absolutely. So it's at your own peril, it's at your own, and also please just know we're not encouraging anything or anything like that. I just need mm -hmm. to say that because, yes. yeah, but we're just being open. I'm 29, he's 37. Um, <laughs> I can beat that. <laughs> you don't to me, big man. Hey. Right. Um, so, how old are you and how old is your dad's work friend? Because yeah. this is intriguing. Is mm. it a thing? Do you like each other? Yeah. Like, was it literally just a one night stand? Yeah. Does your dad know yet? Will he ever know? Do you fancy him? I, do you want to get into a relationship? Like, can you imagine? At the end of the day though, it's like your dad's workmate. Yeah. It's not a direct it's a friend. friend, it's a colleague. True. And if you like him, mm. and then you actually did want to pursue something with him, your, your dad, dad knows should him. technically be happy. Yeah, and your dad knows him, so your dad has vetted him. Yeah. Your dad knows if he's a nice guy or not, yeah, or if it was just a one night thing. Hope he's protected, hope him... you loved your life. Yeah. There you go. Your dad as long can as give as... him a reference. Exactly. Your dad can give him a reference. <laughs> your makeup's it... nice. Thank you, baby love. I thought you were looking at me like sweetly. <laughs> <laughs> Delirious. Give me the I'm happy for you. It is wonky, baby. It is wonky. It is, isn't it? It is wonky. Yeah, that's better, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is a bit better. Yeah, I feel like, go for it. If it's something you yeah. want, but what if it- Why is she regret? No, but hear me out, hear me out. What if it ruins a relationship? His dad and his friend, like, can you imagine? They say work friend. Yeah, but work friend, but what if there is a massive age gap and the yeah. dad's not happy about it? Yeah, true. Do you know what I mean? Well, you just got to be open and honest with your dad, I think. I if don't you, think so. If you, oh, really? Why well, start and oh, yeah. build Bridget, don't you Because it's just a regret, isn't it? Yeah. So, yeah. It's not, like you, it's not like you did something like, like, I don't agree with lying or anything. Yeah. But sometimes what you don't know, do you know what I mean? Sure. If the dad's never going to find out, let's just leave it there. Exactly. Do you agree? Next one. Here good we go. start. Well done, They guys. get, They get good. In sex, I queefed so loud that I made him think that it was him that made the noise. Done what so loud? Oh my gosh, he queefed so loud. So like, if I'm right, it's when, you know, you have that suction and then it comes out. <laughs> you know. Oh, don't. You do, you do like when you have some, and it goes. <laughs> I'm, I'm so confused. I don't know what it is. Oh, but you do know. Queefed. Yeah, it's a queefed. It's like. You know when you're not having sex? Yeah. And then it comes out and it's like, and then it goes, oh, <laughs> you right. 
do no, that. No, 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 no. So she did it so loudly mm -hmm. that he actually thought it was a noise he made against her. <laughs> I get you, yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, but he must have thought you broke the bed or something. Oh, oh my god. god. Go you. He must think he is an absolute G unit, mustn't he? Yeah, yeah. He must be like, I'm absolutely destroying her. Yeah, I'm just fucking going there with him in. No, because he didn't know it was a queef. He didn't know. What do you he think didn't. it was? He thought it was him that made the noise, like, as in, like, Argh. Oh my god, I can't <laughs> go. Well done. <laughs> well done who? I don't know. Well done to her for queefing. Yeah. Well done to him well, for thinking it was him yeah, that made well, that. Well. Yeah, Everyone's happy there. True. She's happy. True, she was clearly loving life. Yeah. Because we all know that that normally happens when you're a little bit lubricated. Yeah, so She was <laughs> You can't take it, can you, when I start? Juices are flowing now, aren't they? Oh, no. Okay. Let's go, next one. I was I f I so much on the tube. I f Oh my god, I just said, should I bleep that? Should I yeah. bleep that? Yeah, I think you should. What, and now tell them, fudging? Yeah, I fudging. I was I fudging mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. a guy so much on the tube. I love how we're bleeping swear words, but we're literally talking about griefing. I know. But then that's a sexual matter, and then yeah. that's swearing. And I do swear a lot, but I feel like, what do you think? Yeah, swearing. We don't need to swear. No, because there might be... I know we don't want to encourage young people to be watching it, but there might yeah. be... You know what I mean? Let's carry on. And also, it's an open con an open and honest conversation eye about fudging. sex. Eye-fudging. Eye-fudging. Yeah. So, I was eye-fudging a guy so much on the tube, and I thought he wanted me back. So I wrote with my lip liner, hope it was a honey saw lip liner, my lip liner, my number on a piece of paper, and gave it to him as I left the tube. But I never heard from him. Savage. Wait, did he watch you writing your number down with the with the? This is a problem with people on the tube. And no one bloody talks. No one bloody talks, and everyone does make eye contact. And you know, there could be two people that are quite interested in each other. Do you know what really? Fair bugs play me? to you, though. Yeah, I think so. Fair play to you. Do you know what really bugs? Me? When my friends have told me in the past, or it's happened in the past, where yeah. someone is literally making eye contact with you, and you're like, you're interested in me. Yeah. No one makes the move, and it's like. Do you know what I mean? I used to work when I worked in the club and there'd be a, let's say one of do the girls. Do you know, I'll tell you what, going. I'm going to do something, yeah? Mm. I'm annoyed you've had to use your lip liner. So get in touch and I'll send you out a honey store lip liner. Oh, I can't believe you're going to send her out a pen. You're going to send her out a lip yeah, liner. Yeah, so get in touch. We'll love. send you out a lip kit. Yeah, like we'll send you out a lip, lip kit. kit. Yeah. yeah, love that. But I'm annoyed that, no, I'm not annoyed, but when I used to work in the club, so many of my friends would be like, oh my God, this guy's staring at me all night. And the guy would be staring at her all night. Then. It would be a 3 a.m. jobby where he's absolutely off his face drunk and he'd come up and be like, so can I have your number? And he's all over the his place. His eyes must have been tired by that point as well. Yeah, like he's all over the place. They've he's been eye fudging all night. Oh my God. But he is, he was all over the place and they'd yeah. be like that. And it's like, but I guess it's because people don't have the confidence, but I get no. it. But it's just hard now. And I'm so proud of you for putting your number down on that yeah. piece of paper. If he don't, you don't know. He might have lost the piece of paper. You don't True. know. He might have actually lost the piece of paper. He might not. He might have been interested yeah. in you and eye fudging you back. Maybe that piece of paper's on the Piccadilly line. You never know which line we want. You know what I mean? But in future, take a pen, save your lip liner. It's so hard. What do you say? Sorry. Are you looking at me? What's an eye fudge then? I'll show you. We'll do one now. No, baby, you can't look at me like that. You've got to look at me more like, like you've never seen me before. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Wait, be on the tube, be on the tube. I'm holding I'm on to the, the tube. I'm holding Fucking on to the tube. Fucking hours on air. Oh, yeah. You're doing? You're doing? <laughs> Wait, go again, go again, go again. I'll take you anywhere. Go again, I'm on the tube. I'm on the tube. I've got to have a wedding meal for this. Can't hear anything, so loud down here on the tube. You haven't shit your wedding meal, have you? Baby, you come out of character. Oh go again, go again. One more, one more. One, two. <laughs> I can't, oh I my. can't. So I'm really good at eye fudging. Please, can we do it again? No, we need to go to the next one now. Okay, we need to go on the tube and do it properly. Okay, go on a tube. Okay. But show me your best like, I'll so nice the circus. Look at me like you. No, not like squinty, like. Baby, where are you going? Mm -hmm. Just give me, like, look at me like you've never seen me before. Like, fancy, you fancy me, don't you? Yeah, of course. Yeah, so go again then. I just want my number down on a lip liner. <laughs> on a lip liner? <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Okay, went to a house party and had sex behind a shower curtain while a girl was on the loo. Love it. Blimey. Uh, 
I have no words and I'm... Just pop your head out and go, respect my privacy please. Wait, so listen, were you having sex before she came into the toilet? A, should lock the door, hun, but doesn't matter, who yeah. cares? B, did she know? C, she probably was too drunk, she was just going for a wee, and we all know when you break the seal and you need a wee, you need a wee, so I think yeah, she was so focused on Yeah, as long as she wasn't having number two. Exactly. Because that would have killed your vibe. Would have killed the vibe. Wouldn't it? Oh, can you imagine? Oh, mate. No, sorry. But there's no, no bedrooms available then? Probably not, baby. You know, it's all adventurous, it's all fun. Yeah, what's the shower on? You know, we used to do things that were fun and friendly. No, no, no. We used to do it now. <laughs> I'm just worried my dad's going to come round the I know. Vipers! <laughs> what well, been how's it going? Hi. Yeah, just about to go absolutely ham on my wife. Hi, Sam. Um, yeah. It doesn't matter if she's having a wee, yeah. but she was so in the zone of weeing. Yeah. Because let's be honest, you know when you have a few drinks... Maybe and... she was listening. Isn't it weird? I don't know what it's like to be drunk anymore. It's been so long. Yeah, it's so long. Long for man. Yeah, but I do know that you have that sensation where you wee. Like, even when I hold a wee in now, I'm like, I, lo I love it. Oh, yeah. Do you love it? Yeah, I love the wee. Oh, when you hold it in, you let it go. It honestly feels oh unbelievable, doesn't it? Okay. I'm, I'm ready for the next one. I was cutting my boyfriend's pubes and accidentally cut his balls. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> do you know, apparently, when you actually do cut a ball or something like that, the blood apparently flies. Yeah, it's cut. It have does, you cut it before? Yeah, I've cut my balls out, yeah. How? We're shaving? Mm. And does it fly out? It, no, it doesn't fly out, it just bleeds a lot. Well, it's the same with that, it's the same down yeah. there, my nun, yeah, like it does. It does bleed a lot. Yeah. I mean, well, I can't, he could do his own balls, to be honest. I No, but I respect that. Yeah. You, you shave me down there sometimes. Yeah, why not? Well, when I was pregnant, you had to, but that was yeah. an absolute fiasco. Yeah. He can't shave me down there. No. He was so gentle. I was like, baby, this is actually hurting. You know, it's like actually dragging the hair. Oh. I was like, no, sorry, this is too much. I was in the bath. All that experience I've got with hair. And then we had a mirror down, down there. We were trying to, I was trying to help you, but it wasn't really, it wasn't the no. one, was it? You were just sort of dragging my skin back, but I needed you to be firmer. The you were like, that's going to hurt me. So, well, I hope <laughs> they are. <laughs> I fucking hope they are. Your vagina is, but not yeah. vaginas. Not vaginas. No. Vagina. Vagina, vagina. not for me. <laughs> yeah, but I hope my vagina is for you. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, but not to cut the hair. No. No, okay. Pass. <laughs> Next one. I don't read them. I'm not. Cheeky, I'm, cheeky, I'm, I'm, I'm gazing, but I'm not. Okay. I'm ready. I had sex on the historical walls that surround the Chester city centre. A, I need to see these historical walls because I didn't know that. Historical walls? Is it like walls? the Great Wall of China around Chester? Are they really bumpy? Wait, so did you have sex standing up on them? Wait, could people see them? Who was it with? The zookeeper? Isn't it crazy how when you're younger, or like, you know, how? you're a bit It must have like, been at night. You're, yeah, it has to have been like, but it's still cold having sex at night. Yeah. But when you're drunk, you just don't feel much, do you? You might not have been drunk. Yeah. You might have just been loving yeah, your life. Why? why not? Is it illegal though? I'm just quickly saying, is it illegal to have sex outside? Yeah, I think so in public, yeah. Is it? Yeah. So let's not go and, well done, but let's not go and tell people to do this. No, absolutely no. not. But we've all done it, you yeah. know. Did you might fall in an animal cage. Is it a zoo? Didn't she say it was a zoo? No, she said Chester City Centre. Where the hell have I got a zoo? <laughs> <laughs> Has Chester even got a zoo? Yeah, has it? A big one? I think so. I thought it said on no, the... No, are you on, thinking outside... of Chester or Chestington? Chester. Chester Zoo. Chester hasn't even got oh one. Oh my word. Did you, you not hear me say? It's a late night for Did us. Did you not hear me say? You might get caught by the zookeeper. You said at Chester Zoo. Because I said, you not, you not hear me say it as well. I think I said, did people not see you on the way in or something like that? <laughs> Way too good. You know that bit where it hurt before? Yeah, it's right. come back. There you go. No, baby, it hurts. I know, we get to dentist. <laughs> How does it? Okay, next one. Next one. I'm sleeping with my stepbrother. What? You're allowed, aren't you? Are you? Well, there's no blood rel relation. Blimey. Because doesn't she do it in Clueless? 
in Clueless, a film you've not seen with me yet, baby. We need to watch some chick flicks. But I, I think she gets with her stepbrother in the end. I think her stepbrother becomes her, like they fall in love. Josh, I think his Super name is. Stepbrother, wow. I think you're an owl angel. But what do you think about it though? It's not for me. Oh. It's not for me because. Oh. Well, it's not for me because I'm married. That's close. That's flipping close. It's close. And what if something goes wrong? I know that sounds pessimistic, but like, I mean, you fall in love with who you fall in love with. Who are we to judge? Don't want to judge, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, we're cousins. <laughs> <laughs> God. Where is this going? We actually had to prove we weren't cousins when we got married. No, we to, yeah, we have to prove we're not. So I have just had to force her. No, <laughs> no, you do get asked that when you get married, don't you? Yeah. Like you have to. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Huh? I can't. There's no battery. People are gonna think that that's why we've never told the story of how we met because we're actually. Oh my now. god! My god! Haters oh gonna hate. Oh my god! Anyway. <laughs> As long as you're happy and you're in love and yeah. it's not going to cause any drama in your family and your family are happy for you, who are we? Yeah, right. Who are right. we? No judge. Um, no judgment here ever. We were having anal sex and I had really bad IBS that day. My mm. stomach started cramping and he ended up having more than he bargained for Jeez. all over him. Shit I can handle bed. my heart, holy shit say. Bed. Shit the bed. Yeah, yeah. Wow. shit the bed. Poo is normal. We yeah. all poo. Yeah. If something's going up there, things might come out. Well, he must have known the risk he was taking because if you had an RBS all day, I'm sure you would have told him. Yeah, well, and he also... Would have, he would have worked it out from being on the toilet quite a lot of the day. Also, am I right in saying that, you know, if you're having sex, front bum sex, front... Mm. If you're having vaginal sex, just, was, did just she, quickly, did she, did she other she... things come out at that point. And also, yeah. I don't know, can you wee during sex? I don't know. But like, if it's going to go that way, but... What was he like? Was he not happy? Yeah. Was it? Ah. Oh. Did she say she was having anal? Mm. So sh was wasn't your bum a little bit sore anyway from being on the toilet all day? Well, yeah, you have IBS, you know. Yeah. Do you think you have IBS? Oh, no, I think my stomach just. It sounds like. What do you think it is? Just certain foods, maybe mushrooms. Mushrooms. Yeah. It's been good. It's been very good. But it yeah. Is. But yeah, I mean. I mean, you could have been a bit more considerate and just stuck to the front. It's been a bit better since you've been doing your skin as well, I reckon. You reckon? Don't you think? How are you finding your skin, baby love? Getting there. It's still red though, isn't it? Well, it's only the tiniest bit red. I think it looks amazing. It's getting there. All around here is, like, do you know what I mean? You've come so far, it looks amazing. Yeah. One more month for tablets. Okay. And then what, you go back yeah, for about, a few... Yeah, about the red Yeah, ones. sorry, we're just talking about his dermatologist. Um, well, what was he like? Was he supportive and understanding? Yeah. I mean, he's putting it up there. He knows what could yeah. potentially happen. Risk, we rewards. You know what I mean? I've been sleeping with a married man for months and I went to school with his daughter. What? I've been sleeping with a married, married man, man for months and I went to school, school with his daughter. daughter. So right. he's a married man and you know the mum and the daughter. God. Wow. That's pretty savage, isn't it? No judgement. But... What can you say? We're in a really... In these situations, we find it really hard because morally for us, how we would behave yeah. and how we speak to each other uh -huh. is like... You know, yeah. whatever. So, but we obviously don't want to judge someone else. We don't know your story. We don't know his story. We don't know everything. We can't judge. Who are we to judge? We're not God or I don't even know whatever we could be. You know what I mean? Yeah. We're not perfect. But I find it hard to, because I am a married person. Accept that. Yeah. And like, you're a man. Mm -hmm. I'm a woman. Yeah. So if it was to do with our morals, we don't think that's right. No. Yeah. But everyone is different, each to yeah, their own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know what to say, really, in that situation. Yeah. What do you actually, what would you say? Well, they they what just say what they're say? doing. They just yeah, say... they're just telling us what, we're do what they're doing. Yeah. I mean, oh, I don't know. It's such a tricky one, Because if you it? know his daughter, like, oh, That's a messy situation. Like, he's having an affair, and you, like, he's having an affair. God. Whether someone's ma marriage or something isn't working, I don't agree with that no. myself. But 
You don't know situations people go through. We don't. No. We don't. No. We don't. So yes, we can say on the surface we don't agree with cheating. Yeah. We don't know everything. Yeah. But obviously we're talking to you who's the mistress as such. It's just... It's such a sticky situation. It really is. Yeah, not nice. No. And I'm sorry if you're going through it because it's probably hard for you as well because you're probably torn. You're probably in love with this person. Mm -hmm. And they're not with you as such. So... Yeah. Hopefully you can resolve make it. Him commit. Make a decision. You know. Yeah, but if he does commit, then that's a whole marriage. That's a whole family. Yes, I know. No, Do you see? I mean, anyone's gonna yeah, be hurt here. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Savage. And we probably said the wrong thing. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, well, we're not. We're not giving advice. No, but we. But we've probably said the wrong thing in the sense that we're probably gonna offend someone. So I don't know yeah. what to say. No. Go and move on to next. Yeah. One. Move on to the next. That's one. probably the best idea. Yeah. Okay. I weed on my boyfriend's bed the night before we went on holiday, and I told him the water just leaked everywhere. Brilliant. What? Excellent, Excellent excuse. Excellent. You could have just, the water bottle could have fell. Yeah. That's that. He didn't smell it. Yeah. His own fault. Yeah. So, best thing to do. Exactly. Yeah. Blame it on the cat. Exactly. You could do anything in that situation, couldn't yeah. you? Blame it on being in the, the zoo. Yeah. Why don't she, she weed on the bed? So she weed on the bed and they obviously were next to each other and then she was just like, oh my God, the water's gone everywhere. And she just put a bottle of water there. Like Brilliant, that. I bet he knew none the wiser. Not during sex or anything like that. No, just, no, just, just literally chilling on the bed, just maybe like... Watching Netflix. Oh, Bridgerton, yeah. wee wee. Well, well, Spence, pelvic floor is the thing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I know. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, uh, if he knows none the wiser, brilliant, sweet, you got away with that one. Clean Yeah, slate. exactly. Maybe try poo next time. Have you ever kept anything from me? No. No? No. So that wet patch last night was nothing. Hey. <laughs> okay, ready, baby? Let's finish. Last one. Yeah. Got the condom stuck up me once. That was fun. Wow. Well, wow. Well done First, for using protection. Yes. Secondly, well done for using condoms because I am not the biggest fan of them. Yeah. But if you need to use them, you need to use them. Absolutely. You know, people think that you always have to use contraception, but it's not just contraception, it's protection from STIs. Yeah, boys sometimes rely on the girl far too much. Yes. Oh, you know, they should be on the pill. Yeah. But boys, we need to take action. We need to wear condoms, you know? Yeah. It's, we both want to have sex. It's not just up to one and person also, to a, provide. Now being parents, a baby is, More sorry to be like, yeah, like the, a baby is the most incredible creation you can ever make. If you're not thinking straight and something happens and it gets brought into a situation yeah. where... we actually said that the other day, didn't we? Yeah. Like, sex creates a life, life. like it's quite yeah. a big action yeah and i think like, when you're younger you don't actually yeah, understand you, you that you don't think like you don't know, think you'll fall pregnant on one night stand yeah yeah it's mad but do you know, know what i mean so how do you anyway, get it sorry, out yeah. do you have to get a firefighter's round or? no it's actually a thing it can get stuck up you and it yeah. sort of just comes off at the top and then yeah it's a bit it's a bit you know you've got to go in there and get it out and be like a little Blimey. scooper yeah mm -hmm. yeah wow well go you girl because you got it out i've heard some people get them you know those cups that you can have the menstrual cups mm. where you put them up you to yeah. catch the period blood? Yeah. Some people have got them stuck up them. And apparently it's literally like a suction cup to get out. Like, can you imagine? Yeah, right. Blimey. And then the cup obviously has period blood in it. Wow. So that's a whole nother thing. And you that's have to get someone else to get it out for you. Sure. I'd like to try one of those period cups. Really? Yeah. Don't get stuck up you. Mm -hmm. I'll get you to get it out. Oh, okay. Because um, you're always doing something. Hey. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm always doing something. I love you. Shall we end the video? Blink, blink twice if you need help. Oh, I know. Blink twice if you need help. My God. Imagine you went... <laughs> <laughs> blink twice. Oh, I know. You don't want to blink them. No. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Sorry if you feel like you're a gooseberry there because we're yeah. just a bit intense. Um, I love you guys so much. I hope you had a good bank holiday weekend. See you on Saturday for another video. It'll be a long one. It'll be a vlog. I'm so excited. I've got lots of different things to be showing you and lots of different vlogs to be talking about. I don't know what I'm saying. Just click off this video. I love you guys so much. Until next time, Please I'm going to love you. Please give us a massive you. thumbs up. I love you guys so much. Until next time, I'm going to leave you. I'm going to love you. No. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh. Get up. It's going gonna, it's gonna to run out of batteries. Go. Oh.